Welcome to this Tutor to You Sociology topic video on beliefs in society, looking at the work of Malinowski on religion. Anthropologist Bronislav Malinowski conducted research into the Trobiand Islanders in the South Pacific and analysed the stress and anxieties brought about by the crises from different stages in the life cycle. Malinowski argued that religion performed a psychological function at specific life stages the birth of a child, puberty, marriage and death. And this helps to develop social cohesion, particularly as these events have the potential to destabilise an individual's commitment to the norms and values of wider society and potentially disrupt social order if left unchecked. The stress of these life events, Malinowski found, was often alleviated by religious ceremonies. These provided support in times of emotional stress linked to these life events. Approaching his research from a functionalist viewpoint, Malinowski suggested that events in an individual's life that are marked by significant changes have the potential to unsettle individuals. For example, the birth of a child causes many changes in the relationship between the parents of the child and between other members of the family and friendship groups. The same is true of a death of a loved one with periods of grieving having the potential to disrupt the ordinary day-to-day -day activities of individuals. Malinowski argued that these stages in most societies were marked by ceremonies. For example, in Christianity, the birth of a child is often celebrated through baptism, while in Judaism, puberty, or coming of age, is marked by bar and bat mitzvahs. While most world religions have differing ceremonies and rites of passage for marriage and death, Malinowski argued that celebrating these stages removes some of the anxieties and uncertainty of these events, with friends and family coming together to celebrate or grieve for those they love, thus making people feel part of something bigger. In his research, Malinowski observed the behaviour of the Tropiand Islanders, in particular the ceremonies and rituals they undertook. He found that before dangerous tasks such as ocean fishing, they would perform rituals that have the function of alleviating the stress of those that were going to undertake the activities while providing some comfort to the friends and loved ones left behind. This performed the function of rationalising any deaths that may occur as being the will of the gods, which allowed those to, who may have suffered personal loss to channel their grief more effectively and lessen disruption in society. We can apply the psychological functions of religion that Malinowski found to different life events. For example, the presence of ceremonies marking the coming of age of individuals turning a potentially upsetting period of life into a rite of passage. But it's not just during coming of age that these ceremonies exist. For marriage, each major religion brings people together to celebrate the union of two people who choose to marry, with celebrations and rituals that have been passed down through the ages. Ceremonies such as circumcision in Judaism or the shaving of the head in some Islamic and Hindu denominations are part of larger ceremonies where individuals come together to celebrate the birth of a new child and their commitment to the faith. And death. Whilst mourning periods differ according to different religions and rituals for the interment of the body may differ from one religion to the next, the main function of these ceremonies is to allow those that feel grief a socially acceptable way of displaying those emotions in a manner that will not upset the established social order. In evaluation of Malinowski's approach, it can be argued that Malinowski saw religion as being based not upon supernatural belief, but rather about the social and emotional connection between individuals and the development of support systems that will provide comfort to those in times of emotional stress. This fits in with a functionalist definition of religion, which does not include belief in supernatural entities. Secondly, Bruce argues that the decline in religious belief, particularly in the Western world, shows that religion fails to fulfil the psychological functions required, with other methods such as science and particular psychology providing a better understanding of emotional stress for some individuals. Religious belief does not necessarily need to fulfil those psychological functions in contemporary Western society. That concludes this Tutor to You Sociology topic video on beliefs in society, focusing on the work of Malinowski on religion. Thanks for watching.